Corey, you, 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 you're in love with somebody, I sense, who has got these really troubling beliefs. Yeah, I mean, um, we had a lovely relationship. And I do use the word had because oh. it, it doesn't feel like it's there anymore. Um, so it, it, it all started with sort of COVID. When it started initially, I think I had, no, I know I had some sympathy. Mm. Um, so he's in the um, hospitality industry. Okay. He was furloughed. He was having a really, really hard time. You yes. know, the um, government furlough scheme wasn't paying that much. Living right. in London's expensive. Sure. It was stressful. So I could understand him sort of wanting to think COVID was just the flu. And hoping it would Trying just to go persuade away. himself that things weren't that bad because then his exactly. own life would improve sooner rather than later. That's a, that, yeah, that makes yeah. perfect sense. Yeah, and I, I got that. You know, I had empathy with that. But then when it started sort of, um, and it's actually, you know, quite a few of the same things that your last guest was talking about. Mm. Um, so Bill Gates is evil. And what do we know what, why? Do we know why Bill Gates is evil? I've tried to dig into this. and. Yeah. Honestly, apparently, his yeah. thought is that um, Bill Gates wants to kill off the lower classes. Um, right. And I can't, I have tried to explain that without the lower classes, you know, or the less wealthy people, the wealthy people wouldn't be wealthy. Yes. Their wealth wouldn't mean anything. Well, you, you could just call them customers, couldn't you? <laughs> to make that <laughs> point. Like, sorry. But it, again, it doesn't go anywhere. Why not, and Cora? And I, I know I this is tough for you, but I, 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 you, you've given it more thought than I have because it's so much closer to home for you. Why does it, So we've actually done quite yeah. well on the why does he want to believe it? Because oddly, yeah. it's quite prosaic explanation because he wants to believe he's going to be back on his feet financially sooner rather than later. Exactly. But then the stuff that they believe, that he believes, is amazing. Frankly. I, I, I do wish it just sort of ended there. Mm. But then... Somehow it goes into um, Donald Trump is actually a really good guy. And the reason why he wanted to build the wall yeah. between America and Mexico is because the Mexicans are responsible for child trafficking and Donald Trump is trying to stop that. Well, this is QAnon stuff, right? I, <laughs> this is the back to the pizza restaurant that has no basement. But yeah. in that basement, there's a, an international child trafficking ring involving some of Hillary Clinton's friends. And apparently, Rock kept child sex slaves in the White House. Right. Um, and you, and I, you're, I, well, I, I don't know what to say to you, Cora. I can, yeah. I, you know, I thought, I wondered whether you were nervous yeah. about being on the radio, but clearly the tension in your voice is built upon the consciousness of just how how scary this is that someone you... It is, yeah, terrifying. That's actually how I would describe it. Because <sighs> I, I, I don't, I, I don't understand. Um, and this is all um, just from falling down rabbit holes on the internet. It seems that way, yeah. Um, there's also the George Soros stuff, which I've tried and tried and tried to explain is anti-Semitic. Mm. And it's, <sighs> so he, he apparently got the idea into his head that George Soros was trying to buy Hungary. Right. Tried to prove it wasn't true. Yeah. And then tried to bring in the fact that do, um, Donald Trump tried to buy Greenland. Yeah, though that's actually true, isn't it? That bit, yeah. sort of. I mean, you, you, you know, in the same way that he tried to sell bleach as a cure for coronavirus, it did actually happen. Although the plausibility yeah. of it would be, what but are you going to do? It, it doesn't. He doesn't accept that. You know, when it's about Donald Trump doing something wrong, the the grab him by the, you know, yes. that's just locker room talk. There's um, um, BLM is Antifa's evil right. and trying to and i'm a black woman i'm <laughs> saying this oh, of course you are God and almighty i just i can't i've, I've tried i've tried and oh, i can't God. anymore i i care about him i want things to be better for him but i can't i can't keep arguing about it. he refuses to wear face masks on public transport because he thinks it's a means of control he refuses to accept that just a way of protecting everyone. How would it's it be a means of control? Because I've seen this in America. Is he American? Do you mind me asking? No, no. He's, he's actually Hungarian. Hungarian. Oh, Lord. <laughs> um, big Orban fan then, presumably. I don't know. He All seems right. to be warming up to him. He yeah. never was, but he's now kind of warming up they to him. They do seem to go hand in hand, a lot of the things that you've described, don't they? I, I, yeah. I, 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 um, I don't know what to say to you. I think, I think you... I think you know what I want to say, but I'm not sure it's my place. Oh, no, I think it, 
I just come to terms with the fact that this isn't, this isn't what it was and no. I can't keep arguing about well, things. Because that you, it, it's a brick wall, isn't it, I think? Unless, it but I'll keep looking for keys and and, uh, and, 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 and I'll keep signing up people like you to help me. And, and what you've done, and I know this is a scant consolation for the elements of your life that feel like they're falling apart, but you have proved the point I clumsily tried to make about having these conversations from a place of compassion and concern, not from a place of condescension and patronizing. You, 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 you know, this is someone you have loved and yeah. you hate what, you, what he is becoming mm. or has it, become. It, it is really difficult to, to see. It's, oh, it, it's heartbreaking. Of course it's it heartbreaking. Is. And what you've done, again, is this scant consolation for what you're going through. You've humanized this tragedy in a way that i could never have done without your help so thank you but sorry i'm so sorry it, 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 even even if your words hadn't been so carefully chosen the tone of delivery and the, and the sadness in your voice would have made the point so powerfully 